In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to set up shift schedules and rotations in Google Calendar. Whether you're managing a small team or organizing larger group schedules, this tutorial will help you streamline your workflow using Google's versatile calendar tool. To begin, you'll need to navigate to Google Calendar, start by opening your browser and heading over to calendar.google.com. Once you're in, you'll be greeted with your current week's view or whichever format you've set as default. If you're not seeing the week view, you can switch tabs as needed to find the format that works best for you. Now let's dive into setting up your shifts. Click on the specific date and time slot that works for your first shift. This action will open a new event window. Here you'll want to give your shift a recognizable name. Consider using a straightforward label like morning shift to keep things clear. Next you'll set the start and end times for the shift. This step is crucial as it precisely delineates the working hours and helps prevent any confusion. After that you have the option to add a location. Though this step is optional if the shift is location specific, entering this detail can eliminate any potential misunderstandings down the line. If there's any important information related to the shift such as responsibilities or special instructions, you can make use of the description field. This is optional, but providing additional context here can guide and remind the team members of any specifics they need to know. Once all the initial details are filled out, it's time to invite your team members. Use the add guests feature to include employees who will be working this shift. This step automatically notifies them of their schedule, streamlining communication and ensuring everyone is on the same page. After you've double checked all the details, click save to lock in the event. This action creates this shift schedule in your calendar. If you need to set up recurring shifts for rotations, you'll want to go back into the event you just created and click edit. Here you'll notice a does not repeat option. Click the down arrow next to it and choose how often you'd like the event to repeat. This could be weekly, bi-weekly or any other frequency that suits your team's needs. If none of the default options fit, select custom to specify unique intervals like repeating every two weeks or setting an end date for your rotating schedules. Once you've made these adjustments, click save again. This action ensures all recurring shifts are set up as planned. As an additional tip, consider assigning different colors to each shift. Color coding can significantly aid in visually differentiating between various shifts or teams, making it easier for everyone involved to recognize their commitments at a glance. And that's it. By completing these steps, you can effectively manage shift schedules and rotations using Google Calendar, ensuring smooth and organized operations for your team. Thanks for watching and be sure to check out our other tutorials for more helpful tips.